this offense has, has the capability for a lot of things. Um, you know, especially passing the ball, I mean, against the number three defense in the country, we have a move the ball like that. Um, just proves how good we can be, and I'm just proud of the way we fought back. Um, you know, down what, 24 to six? I mean, I had an opportunity to give up, and we did. And that's just the character of the, the guys on this team. What, what flipped the switch for you guys offensively? Because it was everything was working all of a sudden. I mean, we just had to relax. I mean, we were so tight in the first half, and um, you know, just kept building, and building, and then so we kind of we finally came in at halftime and said, you know, relax. And especially after we moved the ball um, on our last drive, could have had a chance to score a touchdown, but kicked the field goal. But that's all right. Uh, I gave us a little confidence, and uh, you know, we just came in halftime and said, you know what? Game. You know, that's what we did. You can't throw game. too many 98-yard touchdown passes. <laughs> no, you don't. I mean, it was a perfect play call and uh, executed well by Rod Owens. I mean, on that little hitch and go, uh, made a great catch and made a great run. So that was pretty awesome. He had a really great game for you tonight. Yeah, he, we have yeah, that's, that's crazy, and uh, you know I, I know I can count on him. A lot of those guys in the receiver position, and uh, you know a lot of people kind of were worried. A lot of people were worried about uh, you know the receivers going into the season, and you know this just proves them wrong. And, and uh, you know I can count on all those guys and make plays. What does this say about the team? That, I mean, you you had alluded to it. You're down 18 points early in the second half. I mean, you're two and four, yeah. four and three. I mean, this team. Could have said, it ain't happening. This is the character of the guys. Um, have a lot of fight in us, and we're never going to give up. And, and it just proves, you know, we love this game. I mean, the guys out, out there playing really want to play and, and are really want to win. And um, you know, we're just doing our best. And, and when we don't give up, we keep fighting, and good things happen for us. Christian, break down that touchdown, the clinching touchdown, for what happened on that play. Um, you know, it was just you know the. the Outside receiver just ran a slanting up, and Bo kind of ran a little wheel route and pumped the slant, and uh, they left Bo wide open. It was a great play call, and um, you know it just worked out well. Yeah, Bo Relaford. Was that Bo, something you they were saving? Back here. So you guys were saving your quiver there? Or? Yeah, well, we uh, we've actually ran it. I mean, what well, Miami game the first touchdown, we ran that play as well. We ran it several times, so uh, I mean, it's just something we got in our arsenal. Did you sense North Carolina being deflated at all after uh, this? Because they were driving. Yeah. You, you guys get the interception. And then bang, you hit him with a 98 yard. Yeah, I think we definitely got the momentum back on our side, and um, and we just took advantage of it and kept rolling. And uh, you know, when we when, when we make plays, when defense makes plays like that, you know, it's, a, it's our job on offense to take you know take control of that opportunity and do something with it. And that's what we did. Something in the locker room at halftime it was a totally different attitude. I mean, we just we just realized that we got to relax. I mean, you know, a lot of guys were, were getting up and talking and um, saying what needed to be said, and uh, you know, we. Just had to go back and relax. I mean, it's something that we've seen all year. When we just go out and play our game, we play well. Do you anything particular to loosen them up? Uh, no, not really. I mean, we were just talking and no dancers or singing this time. <laughs> what did you see in the defense in terms of coverages that you guys felt like you could take advantage of in the week, during the week? Um, ended up happening. Well, I mean, we knew that you know they played a lot of man, they played a lot of soft zone, and um, and then quarters as well, which is you know what we took advantage of on that last touchdown. Um, and we knew that they bite on, on some stuff, and you know, double moves and would get them. So uh, we just took advantage of their aggressiveness. Uh, if you used the uh, third, uh, the third out conversion. It was third and one. You reached over. It looked like the head you stopped initially. You did just talk about that. Uh, you know, I knew that we needed that first down. I mean, that was a big one for us. We knew we had to score. Um, get them. You know, we had the momentum on our side, and, and we had to take advantage of the opportunity. And um, you know, I, I initially got stopped, but I knew, you know, I knew I had to do it for my teammates. And uh, reached across, and luckily gave me. A good spot, so better not get stripped. Yeah, yeah, no, it was close. It was good though. It turned out well. Yeah. Can we call you a running quarterback now? Yeah, if you want. I don't care. I can throw for 390 yards. Good game. Appreciate it. Especially just go through so much adversity. I mean, when you games like this are definitely ones you need. Right, and uh, especially with the group of guys we have. I mean, it's, it's definitely Ooh. an awesome feeling. Well, I mean, it was 24 to six. A lot of teams might have that. Well, yeah. another, another bad night and another bad start. You guys just kind of turned around. Yeah, we did. And, you know, we did the same, almost the same with Yeah. It's just the fight that we have on this team. A lot of good guys and a lot of guys that care. So you intentionally got down by 18 just to kind of make it interesting. Did Aaron Andrews talk to you? Yes, he did. Oh, nice. Are you Mike. jealous? <laughs> yes, I am. Did, uh, she's talking to him later, Mike. Did she, uh, she just won't know. Did she, uh, did, uh, <laughs> that play? Yes, sir, yes, yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Have you guys run that before? Yeah, we have. Uh, first touchdown we scored against Miami was that same play. Yeah. But, he, yeah. he's, uh, but he, is he the primary on that or is it the slant? No, the, the outside guy's primary. Okay. Um, you know, but. Uh, 
Yeah, you guys had some plays early. It seemed like in the first half you guys had plays that were close, but just couldn't. Yeah, it was close. And that, I think that just shows how good the defense that uh, North Carolina had. Um, we really had to execute well, and and uh, you know I think when we were so tight in the first half, we didn't you know we didn't really focus on small things and didn't execute that well. And we finally relaxed. Uh, you know we saw what we could do in second half. That last touchdown pass was that uh, was that your first read? Uh, it was the second guy. Yeah, so that was pumped, pretty awesome. Yeah, pumped, pumped a little slanting up and then uh, left wide open. That was the first guy. Holy shit. That was the first guy on the outside too. Ran a little slanting up and then Bo ran a little wheel. What? Who was that outside? Uh, it was in charge. <laughs> yeah, yes, I guess so. He was one of our one of the, one of the Florida State players. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> well, I just thought it was I thought it was interesting because you stepped up and you've been looking left the whole time, and then it's like. There he is, wide open. Yeah. There's a great job. So you and Owen had the connection. You guys love together. I understand. We were roommates. Uh, that's right. I knew he'd come through for me one time. That's what you said. We had 199. So that's pretty impressive. You couldn't do it too much. I couldn't, man. It was my fault. We'd get right after that if you want to. Appreciate it.